Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Flotsam. Where we last left off, uh, I went and I gathered some stuff and I made that secondary solar still and I think we're gonna move on. Hey. Oh, I know that. Why are those still there? Hmm, that's new. Well, it's not new, it's new to me because I'm just not checking it out. So the maximum number of things we can output. Uh, I'm fine with that sitting where it is. Let's move on. See, I'm really interested in these seagulls. I wonder if they're the ones that bring in the kelp. Very interesting. All right, let's move here to the seagull nest. Let's see what we got here. Whoa, a bunch of metal scrap. Okay, so that's what we'll need to do next, is make a metal shop. Seaweed covered rocks. Okay, this this is where we get the seaweed. And Stefan. Oh, I love Stefan. Lonely seagulls do need friends too. Let's rescue you. Let's take a look at our map. Where's the fishing spots? We're sitting good on food right now. Let's go ahead and mark all of the fishing spots. Ooh, there's one. So, there's 75 fish here. Uh, one more out here. So we got 100 fish. What is that? Just decoration, I'm assuming? you making some more wood. Or firewood, excuse me. You're going out to fish. Even though that one's closer. Mm, I guess that one's bigger? So we're currently out of fish to dry. Our inventory's almost full. We should probably build down some. Let's build out to the edge. Can we build off this way? We can. I don't know that I want to. Why have we not gone to get Stefan yet? Oh, we've got to un unload the boats. Ooh, I'm excited. Let's go get Stefan. Cool, so what do you do? Oh, he hauls stuff. Place a salvage buoy for seagulls. So he salvages. Awesome. I wonder if he's super fast or something. What do we want you to get? Stefan, go get us a bunch of wood. Oh, cool. So hauling and scavenging. I want lots of seagull pals. So, I think we need to build some more storage yards. We'll build two for now. We might need to build a secondary firewood place. Although, I also kind of want to go ahead and check out the scrap smith. Yeah, let's unlock that. And then we'll need a lot more. 
of that. A lot more metal scrap. Is that where you're going? Cool. Yeah, alright, so we'll get that. So he seems to focus primarily on hauling, because I set him up a seagull scavenging point, but he's not really doing it. Hauling secondary. Sleepy. Getting hungry. Perfect health, though. Oh, so he can only carry one at a time? Ew. I mean, I get it. Not upset about it. Set this here. So we definitely want to pick up all of that. You know, though, now that I think about it, he might actually be better utilized hauling. So I have changed my mind. Focus on hauling, my dear friend. Go ahead and get some more firewood going. So then I wonder about our research, what we should do next. Because that would probably be really good. But we definitely need the scrapsmith first. Because we need a lot of screws and pipes to build this. We might go for this next. I mean, that's nice and all, but we've got a dedicated fisherman. How's that hauling going? 12 left, so one more trip, 1.2 more trips should do it. Where's our other scavenging boat? Uh oh. Hey, so long. Hey, hey, yo. Uh oh. That may not be good. You know what, let's do a save. Uh, doesn't really matter. I guess we need to name it something. Okay, W. Let's back out real quick, and let's load that save to see if that fixes him. Because he's stuck, and I'm worried he's going to die. Okay, good, that fixed it. I was worried. Because if you look, his health was not doing so good. Can you get back in time? Oh no. Hurry! Hurry! Go take care of your needs so you don't die. Oh, thank goodness. Yep, yeah, rest, relax. You got stuck. Got the seagull nest. We got the seaweed covered rocks. And we're almost done with that. Need the firewood. We can probably get rid of both of these and just build the one big one. I don't know if these are good investments or not.
Well, that drying rack is very confused. I'm not familiar with a viaduct. Look at the concrete island over there. Those beached metal manatees could be dismantled to make our next buildings. I see. So we're gonna have to be careful now to make sure nobody gets stuck. Cause that was close, we almost lost. Uh, Cannonball? No, what's his name? Sammy. Where are you? He's grabbing a snack. Hey, awesome. All right, let's build the scraps. why we're running so low on food this time and we weren't before. Maybe we need more drying racks. Yeah, we'll make another one, put some fish on there. The weary guppy. The buoyant bucket and the trawling bucket. Yeah, he's definitely useful as a, har a hauler. So next we can go up here for some oil. We can go here for some water. Or we can go here for an abandoned town. We only have two oil, though. Kind of wish we'd gone here and then could go here, but I am very happy to have our, our friend. Oh, here doesn't cost us oil, because we're going with the, uh, with the wind. That's cool. So we can go here for one oil, and then go here for another one with some extra villagers. Okay, I think I want to do that. I don't know, though. May change with the tide. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we're done with that. And then for the research for the big desalinator. Oh, that's so far away though. It's 15 points. Fresh water in large amounts. We will put fish on there for now. We're very low on wood. We can make pipes and screws. Hmm. I'm debating on what we want to do, because that might be important now, actually. We need a plastic recycler to make the nets. We'll need screws for that. We're actually doing okay on water right now, so I, I do think we want to go with the fishing hut. Which means we'll need the plastic recycler first. Wow, that's 30 points away. Are you guys getting the water out of here? Yeah, okay, you are. And then I, I guess let's go get some kelp. Or seaweed. I don't know the difference between kelp and seaweed. So 
So, at this time, we built this for nothing. We might need to get a secondary fishing boat, actually. What do we need for this? We need a rope. Alright. Listen here now. Build me a rope. And then some more firewood. Fuel. Some workshops will need fuel to function. Yep. Yeah, I'm aware. Thank you, though. I'd rather you tell me twice than not at all. Does Stefano need a house? Okay, then. We will build you a house, my friend. Stretch that out as much as possible. More solar stills I don't think would be a bad idea, but it might. Hmm, fish kebabs. Grills fish, simple but tasty. It exports cooked fish, which is better than drying them. So maybe we should do that next, just to help with our food situation. Because we're getting a little, little sketchy on the foods. Let's build you a house there, friend. I mean, you're a seagull. We don't know why you need a house. But I will not deny you one, dear sir. Absolutely not. Go ahead and build another drying rack. We'll change that one over to wood. And then we'll have three and three. And, uh... Okay, we're already salvaging that. Good. Hey, we're done. Neat. Let's set a swimming... Nope, can't do it. Let's set a swimming buoy over... here. Just get us some more wood... And then I do think we want to build one more pier. And then put a fishing boat there. Which I guess we won't need all these drying racks once we can actually cook the fish. Fish dried in the sun. Not very tasty, but it'll keep you alive. Yep, we got that. And then we got the solar stills. Well, with the solar stills, we can get the salt from it and salt our fish. That's that's not actually a game mechanic. I'm just being a goof. So right now, it looks like our food and our wood are the things we're short on. Got you making the wood runs. There's plastic over there, which, I mean, we will need before too long. And that, oh, I thought some of that was wood. Plastic, plastic, wood. One piece of wood all the way out there. Sure. Let's get that one. Oh. I want those two things out there. What a waste of a run. I don't care. And then what do we have here? Okay, we've already got someone on that one. And then let's make another fishing boat. We might need to set somebody up as a secondary fisherman. What are you currently doing? Crafting at a workshop. Uh, let's set your fishing duties to two. 
That way when you're not crafting, you can be fishing. So next, I do think I want to go here. To the shack town. So we can get whatever's left here at this abandoned town. And then we'll probably move forward to get more people. Hopefully the abandoned town will give us some more research points so we can cook our fish. Because that ain't good. So we got you going for fish. If it won't give us fish, here's hoping it'll at least... Or if it doesn't give us research points, here's hoping it'll at least give us some canned food. Well, we're gonna have to leave very soon because we're almost completely out of fish. That poor little car. But for every fish, we're only getting half a nutrition. Once we do the research to where we can actually cook them... That'll give us at least one full nutrition. Yeah, it looks like we don't have any more fishing buoys. Just that one. And it's almost done. And we got our second fishing boat. So that will be helpful. One piece of wood. We're doing okay for wood right now. Eh, we'll just leave it. Doing okay on wood, doing okay on plastic. So yeah, food is our issue right now. And that takes, what, five? Yes, yeah, so we should be able to unlock that in the next one. Because yes, we do have enough metal scrap to do that, thankfully. How are we doing out here? We are out of fish. It leaves some marker there though, so I'm wondering if the fish repopulate. I mind if we didn't eat all of them. Food reserves are low. No kidding. Okay, so we need to move on so we don't starve. But I'm going to go ahead and call this one here. That way we don't get five minutes into the the next episode on the, uh, the next island. And then it just kind of gets it out of sync, you know. It, it seems to work pretty well getting one island per episode. So this one will just be a little shorter, but that's okay. You guys don't mind, right? See, I knew you didn't mind. As always, thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.